Hey everybody, welcome back to Toy Notes with me, Kelsey. If you guys thought Hatchimals were big last year, just wait. I've told you that 2017 is going to include more trends towards collectibles and the little mini play sets and interactive play sets. Well, I introduced to you Hatchimals Collect EGG to bowls which is playing on all of those things. It's playing on the fact that Hatchimals were the hottest selling toy last holiday season. They are miniature and there are uh, the blind boxes and they're interactive. So these are a collectible series of hatching little creatures from Hatchimals and I'm gonna demo them for you guys today. So let's go ahead and get them open. All right, it's time to hatch some Hatchimal Collectibles. We've got a four pack here and our first little friend in the center. These are supposed to be color changing hearts. And I think they're supposed to tell you whether or not you have a common, rare, ultra rare or whatever, um, but we'll see. The back of the package shows, um, like I said, that there's supposed to be a color changing heart and then all the different collections that they have so far. And then this is just season one. So opening it up. You can pull out the package insert that'll actually give us all of our different characters. Now they're set from places like ocean, forest, desert, and then they have a little map of where they come from right there. Let's see. So I'm gonna keep that here so I know who I'm getting. And let's see, let's get these eggs out of there. Whoop. Okay, so this one is from the Meadow collection. They don't really have names, um, but as you can see, it's like a little puppy, and they all have these little silver wings, it looks like. So this is one from the Meadow collection, and it is a common one. So we're gonna set him right there. Now, the Hatchimal collectible eggs, you can see there's a little seam running right here. They look just like their larger counterparts from last toy season. And let's see, if we rub the egg, it's heat sensitive, so when you rub it, it changes the color. Oh, there it goes. See, it turns pink. Now, do they all turn pink? That's the question. That one's also pink. That one's also turning pink and I'm gonna assume this one turns pink too, but we'll see. and pink. So I'm not really sure what the point is because none of the, I mean, I guess the rare ones are all pink, but I have a hard time believing that these are all rare. Um, these two have white speckles on the outside and then this one is yellow and this one is green. So I don't know if that's decoration or if that has something to do with it, but let's open our first one. So I just kind of pressed in. Oh, 
Aww, that one looks like a little baby deer. Let's see, which one is this one from? This one is a common one from the Forest Collection. Light blue, pink face, and then of course the silver wings. So let's do this one now. I'm gonna smush it between the table and my hand this time because it kind of hurt my finger last time. We have here, oh, we have a little lion. This one's from the Savannah Collection. And she is also common. Okay, so I'm gonna get rid of these two eggshells. We've got two more, and then I've got a special surprise for you guys, so stay tuned for that. There's number three. This one's from the Ocean Collection. It's a little whale. See that? That's a whale. And that one's common. So it seems that the color changing heart is just a bonus. It doesn't really mean anything. And the number four. Looks like a little fox. Let's see. Where did this one come from? This one looks like one from the Forest Collection, but it's a different color set. So I'm not sure what that means. This one doesn't seem to belong quite anywhere. I mean, it's adorable. It's a little fox. Kind of got that clear blue look to it. Um, but it doesn't really have a counterpart on the guide that I see. Hmm. Okay. Well, without further ado, I wanted to give you, show you guys the surprise for sticking around through opening all our collectibles, and it, that is an extra hatchable. This is the blind bag version, so you can buy them in the variety packs or you can buy them in a single pack like this. So let's see who else we got. This one's got pink speckles on the outside. Aw, oh, this one is an ultra rare one from the Garden Collection. It's a little slug. Aw, oh, isn't it cute? I did end up with an ultra rare one. So I've got mostly commons. This one I just couldn't place. I can't find any place that this one goes. It looks like a common one from the forest, except it's, instead of being purple with a green face, it's blue with a white face. And I just don't see any that look exactly like that. So I'm going to keep looking, and if I find it, I'll let you know. Otherwise, if you guys find it in your new collectibles from Hatchimals, comment below. Do you know who this is? Well, guys, I'm sitting with the start of my Hatchimal collectibles. I had a lot of fun with these. I think they are going to be huge. They are brand spanking new. Came out just this month. They are going to be... I mean, 2017 is full of collectibles being toy trends, blind bag, blind bags, surprise eggs, um, you know, mystery bags, that sort of thing being hugely trending. And then Hatchimals was enormous last year. It was way bigger than anybody thought it would be. So I think this toy is going to be a huge one. So this is going to be a great one for 2017 gifts. If your kid was into Hatchimals or collectibles, this is a brand new one. And they are adorable. They really are. So go out and get some because everybody's going to have them soon. <laughs> So guys, until next time, make sure you're hitting that subscribe button, checking us out at toynotes.com, and leaving us big thumbs up. 
because we are doing our best to stay on top of brand new releases and the top 2017 trends. That way you know what's hot, what's not, and what's just worth your money after all. But until next time, bye!